I'm going to make a chicken casserole. This is one of my favorite family meals. It's such a crowd pleaser, really good source of protein and vitamins, and it's just perfect for a cozy, cozy evening in. I've got some chicken pieces, and I'm going to brown those first in a pan. So put some olive oil in the pan. Nice little drizzle like that. And season it while it's cooking. Some sea salt. There. And some pepper. So when it's really lovely and golden underneath, turn it over and pop it into casserole pot or saucepan. There, and now cook the second batch. So once all the chicken is browned, I want to deglaze the pan. I'm deglazing it with chicken stock. And deglazing means to pour some stock or some water or alcohol, whatever it is you're using, into the pan to dissolve all those gorgeous little caramelized bits of flavor from the chicken. Stand back. <laughs> About that much. Bring it up to the boil. And this way you get every single bit of flavor that's stuck to the pan all those lovely little bits from the chicken. Pour it over the chicken. There. And now put this on the hob. I'm adding in some halved onions, some carrots. This is full of goodness, this dish. This is exactly the kind of thing I want to eat if I've been out for a run, out in the garden, you know, post-exercise. It's very restorative, nurturing, comforting. I love it. Potatoes as well. And just push everything down so it all cooks in the steam from the chicken. A little bit more salt and pepper over the top. Rosemary I love in here. And now I'm just going to bring this up to a simmer and allow it to cook covered with the lid for about 45 minutes until the chicken is tender and the vegetables cooked. Oh, lovely. So 45 minutes later, the casserole is cooked. So, time to serve. And that's it. Decorate with a little bit of fresh rosemary. How lovely and comforting does that look? That's my chicken casserole.